Ladies and gentlemen, all right, so what we got today is, you know, I've never done an unboxing, so I made a purchase today. I'll probably get a lot of grief, but uh, it's, uh, it's a shortwave radio, and uh, I did a lot of research on different models and what I was looking for, and basically for myself, what I wanted were, I wanted the most up-to-date, uh, most technical technology wise one on the market for under two hundred dollars alright I also wanted one that came with a dial and not a button to search the channels with because I like the old uh, turn knob and I also wanted a large display because um, I can't see the small displays I mean I can but it's just I don't want to strain and I wanted something with a backlit display so if I'm chilling out in, in my bed and I'm, I'm just listening to an, to something just to relax that's something else that was important to me and I wanted it to be small it's something that I can take on deployment something I can take when I travel um, all over the world and I can listen to my uh, talk shows and and music and all different types of things so I'm gonna just get right down to it, <clears throat> it comes in a nice box and uh, just uh, look at that it's got like a little shell encasing Another factor that I considered when I bought this is that um, it is from Radio Shack, so if I have an issue with it, I can just take it to my local Radio Shack. I have basically 30 days to return it to them if I don't like it. So I can try it out. If I don't like how it operates or works, I can just bring it right back to them. I don't have to worry about shipping it back or anything like that. That's pretty nice. It's got no styrofoam. It's good for the environment. A little recycled cardboard. Alright, so it comes with um, an AC adapter, which is nice. It's a nice bonus. And let's see here. Oh, it comes with a protective case. I didn't know that. It's nice. G3. That's, that's actually made pretty nicely. That's nice. That'll be really good because I will be traveling with this. Comes with a standard of quality and a wow, a nice size. Okay, it's different languages. Thank goodness. Um, a nice size um, owner's manual. All right, initial impressions. What am I? What kind of vibes am I getting off this thing? Well. It feels nice. It smells kind of rubbery. Um, okay. I can just take this off right now. I need that. Take off my screen protector. Um, it feels like a quality product. It's nice. It's got like a little thing where I can lever it down like so. That's kind of nice. That's like a perfect camera angle. Look at that. I can also set it down flat. Looks like there's something in the way there. Let's see. Yeah, basically flat. Set up by itself. It's nice and thin. It's got a... Okay, and this, these are things that I keyed in on when I was looking at this. It's got a line out so I can hook it to... It doesn't matter if this speaker is bad because I can connect it to any stereo that I want with any line out. I can connect to my computer or whatever. It's got a nice uh, turning knob. A nice fine tune, which I was looking for. It's got a headphone jack um, and an external antenna too, so I can buy one of them nice antennas. I like it. Nice. Let's throw the batteries in and uh, see what we're talking about here. You know. So. I just want to give a disclaimer. I am by no means uh, a professional ham operator or a radio guy. I just wanted something that um, I could listen to and kind of mess around with. Um, things I do for fun, you know? Just relaxing at home and playing with my radio. And we got a little visitor here. It's my little cat. What do you think about this kitty? Oh, look at that. So it's got a nice display. Let's see if we can illuminate it. Okay, where's my light? 
Oh, okay, well, light, lights up. Really can't see it though. Nice blue. That's like my CB. I love that blue color. It's really nice on the eyes. Um, you can have it where it's always on, or as you saw when I touched the dial, it automatically came on. So it'll stay on for like, I don't know, I haven't read the directions yet, but like 10 seconds or whatever, and there it goes. We'll see if we can tune something in real quick, see what it sounds like. We'll just go to FM, see if we can get something. I don't know if we can. Like I said, I haven't, I have not read the directions yet. From the church and start their march. Oh, cool. Maybe the agent to... orders them to stop and when walks away, then a crowd of government comes in. The six women yell freedom as dozens of pro Castro counter demonstrators surround them. It gets really loud and the sound sounds really nice, especially for talking. I'm, I'm pretty impressed with that. Um, just like your car stereo, you have the auto search or the dial. Um, it's competition, and the one that uh, I was also looking at getting was the Sony ICF SW 7600GR, which I've heard is a better radio. Um, what eliminated that for me was there was no dial and the display was too small. Plain and simple. I can't see the display. I mean, I can, but I'm not going to strain my eyes. I, I want to, you know, the whole experience. Well, so much money that over four million drivers. Sounds really good. Back we try a little AM here. And it has a little signal button there. It tells you how strong your signal is. It's really neat. How about 980? 970. Yeah, the different modes. Seven meter, upper band. A lot of things to explore on this, which will be really neat. Good time. It feels nice. It feels a uh, like a quality made product, and I'm pretty pretty happy with that. Pick up the lights. I feel like I'm bringing down the house here. And the dial really doesn't make that kind of fun. You know, you're dialing in stuff. You're trying to find some interesting stuff. So I'm going to go on the internet and I'm going to download some uh, <clears throat> programs or the program guide. There's There are programs on, on, on certain channels, certain times. It's kind of neat. You can watch, you can listen to them on your new little radio. And uh, so far I'm, I'm impressed. I like it. I haven't played with it very much. And, uh, you know, we'll, we'll see how it, how it does. And if I don't like it, I'll just take it right back to Radio Shack and tell them the product is garbage because I mean I paid a premium price for it if it doesn't do as if it doesn't perform as advertised I'll return it and I think that's a valid reason to return something so that's about it put any little numbers there neato air I don't know like I said I need to read the directions Alright, so I hope you enjoyed my unboxing and that's about it. Take it easy.